But I couldn't <laughs> tell if it was like the mean girl laughing or if it was like the harmless giggling that girls do. But just thinking about it makes me sick to my stomach. Are they some ops or do they already know it's me? Or what if I go up there and they start roasting me? Stanley! Five girls, four of them I've never talked to a day in my life. I wanna say they were all different flavors, but for some reason I do actually remember Lauren being the only brown skin one there. This is not what I prepared for at all. If y'all remember from the last video, I folded on talking to Lauren just because there were two extra people that were there at that moment in time. Mrs. Jill, the counselor, and Ashley, the student aide. What am I supposed to do so surrounded by five girls in front of the girls bathroom i did not prepare for this i was up late night in my boxers practicing in front of a mirror to have a one-on-one -on -one conversation little do i realize i gave her the perfect ammo to get excited about nothing i wanted a quick hi it's me we should talk more conversation but now it feels like i'd be front and center on stage trying to riz up five shorties and i know that me being surrounded by five girls will cause even more attention which is what i'm trying to avoid and you know what this this is my fault i gave her a note without a name on it confessing my love and then i made her wait the whole entire weekend to know who it was that's the perfect scenario for her to think that i'm prince charming when in all reality i'm prince charming ultra soft okay i don't know how i was going to clean this shit up i was scooby doo levels of scared because i would have pulled up on her easily if it weren't for these meddling kids so i'm standing and Inside the guy's bathroom peeking around the corner watching them and then I noticed something that took this situation from being the worst day of this year to the worst day of my life the girls weren't all there cuz they liked me and wanted to date me no 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 no. they were all reading the note that I specifically left for Lauren and all four girls including Lauren are laughing <laughs> at the note but I couldn't tell if it was like the mean girl laughing or if it was like the harmless giggling that girls do but just thinking about it makes me sick to my stomach are they some ops or do they already know it's me or what if i go up there and they start roasting me stanley get it together okay that girl showed up for you don't overthink it okay number one ow that hurt number two what if i'm not who she's expecting expecting bro like that's what i'm saying that's gonna break my heart listen stanley okay it's better for you to have tried and get your heart broken than to have never tried and wonder what if you're right i take a deep breath i walk outside of the bathroom constantly repeating in my head the worst she could say is no the worst she could say is no the worst she could say is no and as i'm approaching lauren all five of the girls look at me and i know for a fact it was probably one second in real time but it felt like that scene on haikyuu when the spiker from shirato rizawa presence was so intense that it pushed everyone on the court into the ground that's what them staring at me felt like and the closer i got the more intense this feeling got and then when i finally got within arm's reach of lauren i'm looking at her face to face on some real grown man shit i turn and walk into the cafeteria hey bro say whatever y'all want i don't care i headed back to the breakfast line so quick it looked like the last time i ate it was just for practice it looked like my last meal was the last supper it looked like dun, 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 dun. sebastian the crab could use my rib cage as an instrument that's how hungry i pretended to be i got out of there so quick because think about it realistically if you had to go up against five girls at once like johnny sins you'll probably fold too you can't even pull off a 1v5 in valorant 2k overwatch what makes you think i have the capabilities to pull off a 1v5 in real life but i didn't even get to the worst part yet and this part till this day actually makes me feel bad i saw her and the four other girls stand there for the whole breakfast period bro you let her stand there the whole period hold on hold on no no it gets 
worse, okay? Every morning for the next two weeks, bro, I promise you, she would stand there with the saddest look on her face, holding the note to her chest. And as time passed, less and less girls were showing up with her until it was just her her at the girl's bathroom and i feel like the note kind of backfired and by kind of i mean i feel like it backfired in its entirety because people were saying she wrote it herself for attention but by now i had felt so bad that i never approached her that even when she was completely alone i still was thinking to myself that it was probably better off if i just let the whole thing die off completely and you know what i'm gonna do something i don't usually do here usually this would be the end of the video right here but years later this girl actually gets transferred again but into my high school and there was this one moment one moment where i was waiting for my parents to come pick me up from school and it was a couple of students like in the waiting area right and all the bench seats were filled up except for mine so she walks over to me puts her backpack down has her headphones in and i'm shaking because i still remember everything like it was yesterday even though it was four to five years ago like this is the closest that we've ever been understand that i got my headphones in too i'm watching something on my phone i don't remember what and for some reason as shy as lauren is herself because she didn't talk much after that incident she looks over on my phone completely invading my privacy i might add and she asked me what video am i watching i think it was like dashy or something i don't know it's not really that important but then i asked her about what she's listening to to and she shows me the song on her phone and just in this one time in this one moment we had a conversation that we were supposed to have four to five years ago and for like the next seven minutes before her parents came and picked her up even though we were laughing and joking and whatever that moment was both the second and the second to last conversation we ever had with each other and the actual last conversation we had together is well i'll um i'll keep that to myself after we graduated she went on to date this dude who was known to be on the football team and i think they're still together to literally right now so she's happy i'm happy and that is pretty much the end of what happened between me and lauren so i hope you guys enjoyed one note five girls it's a wrap fade to black